Keisha Kitchen. My name is uh, Jack Lee. I'm from Los Angeles, California. I used to work at Hotel Bel Air and now I'm here at Acacia. <laughs> so the reason why I love cooking, because this has come from my mom. Learned the cooking from my mom when I was uh, five years old. And uh, she taught me so much and because of her love, I love to cook now and a lot of memories bring back with me and her in the kitchen. You know, uh, being away from my mom and uh, my dad, uh, it was very hard at that time. My father died when I left the country. And uh, it was very hard because we, I miss my mom. You know, I lost my dad. Um, my father uh, died right before I left Vietnam. And it, it was very hard at that moment uh, to, to come to US. So I worked, you know, so many places. Um, but I also finally went to culinary school. I studied and I wanted to get to Hotel Bel Air and I interviewed so many times they didn't want me, you know, because it was hard, you know, because we're different color, maybe, you know, different nationality. And I tried and I tried uh, for 13 times of interview and they finally accept me, but I volunteer. I worked for free for one year, you know, just to prove myself. And finally, I made it. I earned my spot, and I became a chef. I love the colors, and I love the, the presentation. I felt presentation is everything, because beauty is, and people often eat with their eyes first. I grew up in Vietnam and I learned, you know, the street food of Vietnam, right? You know, bò nướng and the bát the bánh mì, right? You know, in the street, all this beautiful. So I combined them both and I call it the Jack cuisine. So I felt this country have the best of everything, the ingredients, the fruits, you know, even the people. The people are so nice, you know, especially the girls. Uh, they, they, they treat me so nice. <laughs> the chef. Love you. <laughs> Mỗi tuần, Jack Lee sẽ mang đến câu chuyện đặc biệt về một ngôi sao Hollywood thông qua một món ăn mà Jack đã từng nấu ăn cho họ. Vì đầu bếp tài năng này sẽ cùng thực hiện lại món ăn đó cùng với một nghệ sĩ Việt Nam và rất nhiều bất ngờ sẽ diễn ra. Câu chuyện về món ăn hôm nay là gì? My eyebrow still there. Yeah. So after all that hard work, right, it finally paid off. Now I'm cooking for the celebrity, the stars, right? Uh, President uh, Reagan, a family, Michael Jackson's family, Angelina Jolie and Brad Pitt. Uh, I love it. I love my life now, right? You're like, hey, right? Everything, you kick the, the bad part, and now everything is good. Why I'm making this dish? Because this dish is Michael Jackson's uh, family's favorite dish. Okay, it's called the, the shrimp with the red caviar. Michael Jackson is my favorite star. Wow, right? Um, if you ever cook for your favorite or your loved one, you know, it, it, it means so much to you, right? It's like it comes from the heart, you know? And so it was a very special day for me when I cooked this uh, for the uh, Michael Jackson family. Uh, and uh, Austin Brown was the nephew of uh, Michael Jackson and this party was so important to them because it was his first album because it's, it's the music that he had, right? My favorite song was Billie Jean's Beat It and uh, Smooth Criminal but it's not just about the singing, right? It's about the dancing, the moonwalk. See that? <laughs>
that's why I dedicate, you know, I also making a drink to go with, you know, what we're doing, the, the shrimp dish. That's why this drink is called the Blue Moon, see, Blue Moon. Um, to commemorate, you know, the, the whole dancing thing. So, uh, which I'm gonna show you how to, you know, and also making the shrimp, we're gonna show you how to make the Blue Moon drink. But today, I really want to see who can join me, right? To make the shrimp and the Blue Moon drink together. Cùng với câu chuyện về ông Hoàng nhạc pop và món tôm đặc biệt mà Jack đã nấu cho gia đình Michael Jackson, nghệ sĩ Việt Nam nào sẽ đồng hành cùng với Jack hôm nay? That's sweet. I'm excited. Yeah. Wow. It's Thanh Thi. Queen, I'm so lucky today. Yay. Thanh Thi sẽ cùng Jack làm món tôm này như thế nào? Đón xem ở phần tiếp theo nhé.